Welcome to Encouraging Word. You know, one of the most difficult lessons that any person of faith uh, has to learn is that God's ways are different than our ways. His way of thinking is different than our way of thinking. Isaiah 55 says, For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are my ways your ways, declares the Lord. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. Some things in life just don't make sense to us. Uh, just as in the Bible, some stories don't really make sense to us. When God told Abraham to sacrifice Isaac, that just does not make sense in any way, shape, or form. God doesn't ask for human sacrifices. We know that. Isaac was a child of promise. He was the child of Abraham and Sarah's old age. Why would God make them wait so long to have this child, only then to have them ask him to sacrifice him? It just doesn't make sense. Even Abraham's reasoning behind this doesn't make sense. Hebrews eleven nineteen says that Abraham reasoned that God would raise Isaac from the dead. That just does not compute in any way, shape, or form. I mean, seriously, how does that make sense? It just doesn't. Trying to figure out God is going to be a challenge for everyone. And that's why faith is so important. Uh, we have to always keep in mind the simple truth. Hebrews chapter 11, verse 6 says, Without faith, it's impossible to please God, because anyone who comes to him must believe that he exists and that he rewards those who earnestly seek him. Uh, simple, but hard. God is, and he rewards those who earnestly or diligently seek after him. You need to keep that in mind today, and you really need to stop trying to figure God out. You need to put your faith in him and in his word. Let's pray together. Father, thank you for your word. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your grace in our lives. And Father, thank you for the gift of faith. Help us to believe. Help us to trust. In your name we pray. Amen. Hey, thanks so much for taking time to watch. God willing, I'll be here tomorrow with another word of encouragement. Have a great day.